What's going on everyone? It is Brad or Demon Asylum here. I'm bringing you all a new Fallout 4 video. I'm going to be showing you all one of the best and most useful glitches that I have uploaded on this channel to date. This one's going to allow you to duplicate any size stack of ammo that you want. So for instance, if you have a stack of 500 ammo, you're going to be able to turn that into a thousand. Now a lot of people were really disappointed with the dog meat duplication glitch in terms of ammo because if you tried to duplicate a stack of 500 ammo for instance, dog meat would only ever drop one round back instead of another stack of 500 like you originally dropped. Using this glitch I'm about to explain to you all though which again is a variant of the dog meat duplication glitch basically with a couple additions on top of it you are going to be able to take any amount of ammo in a stack drop it on the ground and duplicate it to get double the amount. So the first thing you want to do is of course make sure you have dog meat as your companion because you're going to need him to do the duplication glitch and then you're going to want to choose whatever ammo type it is you want to duplicate and drop the whole stack of ammo on the ground where you're comfortable doing the dog meat duplication glitch. Now to actually do the dog meat duplication glitch, it's a very simple concept. You're going to want to command your dog to go a few feet away from whatever item is on the ground that you're duplicating. And then you're going to want to command him to come and pick up the item. And once he gets close enough to the item that he stops walking towards it and he stands still, you're going to wait about a second, if not even that long. And then you're going to want to pick the item up yourself. Now, if you time it correctly, you'll notice that his head goes down and picks up the item as well. And you will have both the item back in your inventory as well as he will come up to you and drop the item on the ground so you will have double of the item. Now if that's not good enough of an explanation for you guys that don't know how to do the duplication glitch already, I will go ahead and put an annotation on the screen as well as a link in the description to the dog meat duplication glitch where I have way more in depthly explained how to do it as well as given many more examples. Now back to the actual ammo stack duplication, once you have successfully done the dog meat duplication glitch with whatever ammo stack you want to double, you will end up having your stack of ammo that you duplicated back into your inventory as well as that same type of ammo on the ground that dog meat drops from the duplication glitch. From here, what you're going to want to do is go into your inventory again and drop that same stack of ammo that you just duplicated with on the ground. So just so we're on the same page, at this point, you should have your stack of ammo on the ground that you duplicated with. And along with that separately, you should have the ammo of the same type that dog meat dropped from the duplication glitch. From here, what you're going to want to do is go into your settings menu where you can choose to quit to the main menu or save your game or load a save. And you're going to want to choose the option to quick save. So you're manually quick save. Saving. You can't just go into your pit boy and get a quick save from that. You have to go into your settings menu and you have to choose the quick save option. Now, once your game is quick saved, you're going to need to quit to the main menu. You cannot just load your quick save. I personally tried to quick save and then right after that, just load the quick save. It does not work that way. Once you manually quick save, you need to go back and quit to the main menu. Now, once you're back at the main menu, you need to load up your most recent quick save that you just manually did. And then when you come back into your game from loading it up from the main menu, you will see that on the ground, you have both of your stacks of ammo with the same number amount on them. And both of them will actually give you that amount of ammo. So I think my first example in this gameplay was the alien blaster ammo. I had like 400 or something of that. And when I came back into my game from main menu, I had 400 something ammo in each stack which of course added up to 800 something so just as a quick recap you're going to want to do the dog meat duplication glitch with whatever ammo stack you want to duplicate and double you're going to leave the ammo that dog meat drops on the ground from the duplication glitch and then you're going to want to go into your inventory and drop the ammo stack that you just duplicated with back onto the ground and then you're going to manually quick save and then you're going to quit to the main menu and then you're going to load that quick save that you just manually did. And when you load back into the game, both stacks of ammo will have the actual amount of ammo that your stack originally did, giving you double the amount of ammo. So there you go, guys, a variant on the dog meat duplication glitch, which actually allows you to easily double the amount of ammo you have in any stack. Now, as usual, if there's anybody who has questions or confusion regarding this video or more specifically the glitch that I showed in the video, just go ahead and post a comment and I will be sure to get back to you as soon as I can and help in any way that I can. Aside from that, I hope you all have enjoyed the video or found it helpful. If so, feel free to drop a like on it down below and subscribe for many more Fallout 4 videos to come. Thanks for watching everyone and peace out.